My life uh, before my injury was, uh, you know, I got hurt when I was 19 years of age um, and just on top of the world going to school. After a, a friend's party in Huntington Beach and drove uh, to Pacific Coast Highway to go check out the waves because I was going to surf the next day with my girlfriend and uh, just glance at the waves. It was probably about 11 at night and uh, just just turned around and uh, started driving home. I live pretty close to, uh, to the beach. And uh, from that point, I got hit by a drunk driver. He was running from another uh, accident and he killed a girl in my car. And uh, my life changed forever. Um, it was, uh, now you had a 19-year-old just could accomplish anything in the world to a 19-year-old that was very scared. You know, it, it, it's funny, um, you know, I've always been a kind of a, a techie guy when it comes to, you know, cars and, and bikes and, and, and things like that. So I think at an early age, and I, when I say age, at an early age in my wheelchair life, um, I, I knew how important it was. So I was one of the guys that would take my chair apart and uh, figure out how it worked and see how I could make it better. You know, even before I left the rehab center, that's kind of was one of my goals is to be a, be an athlete, be a wheelchair athlete. I was an athlete prior to my injury. Um, I played sports all through high school, and uh, you know that that kind of just motivated me to get going back and uh, going back in that direction. That's the direction that I went into. I worked hard, and 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 my chair wasn't going to hold me back, so it was it was a part of me. And uh, when that became a part of me, I, I was very proud of rolling around in it. And uh, it, was, uh, it, it was a great feeling. So it was early on in my, in my recovery process that, that I felt that being in a properly fitted chair is the way to go. I, I want to I give that confidence all the time, you know, in a business meeting or when I'm talking to somebody or, or uh, talking to my kids. You know, I, I want them to know that, that, that I'm confident. And, and, and a lot of that has to do with, uh, you know, being fit properly. And, and that that's, uh, means a lot to me. It's, it's the health and wellness of my life. That true fit, fitted product is just like my heart wellness today, exercising. Without having the proper fit in a product, without having that tight fit, all of those things are hard to achieve. Uh, you know, you're, you're, you're going to have uh, shoulder injuries, you're going to have wrist injuries, you're going to have issues in your life to slow you down. I don't have time to slow down. My girls have always known me in a wheelchair. Um, my family uh, thinks, they think of me as normal. I mean, uh, you know, we go on ski trips, you know, I, I can ski better than all of them. And uh, they, uh, they look at me, they don't look at me as being in a wheelchair. They just go, yeah, my dad can do that, not a problem. My kids have always gravitated towards me. They sit on my lap. Um, I have I, I, little babies that they, they fit right here in my lap and I can push my chair. They, they just, they understand it and they can feel it. And uh, that's just about confidence and being a part of your chair. You know, it's just another extension of your body. It's a good feeling.